Alright, so this is where we came in. So let's kill the knife guy. I don't like him very much. Yeah, this is an expensive looking knife. I can't believe he left it stabbed in our gut. And also didn't check to see if we were dead. That seems a little odd. All right, so I'm guessing the commander guy in here that we're trying to kill is the guy who was torturing us. This is, oh, I thought this would be locked, but it's not. Got an Enigma code piece, Thigma Bob. So this guy is gonna be coming back around here in a second on his loop. Whew! That was really close. Alright, let's take this guy out first to reduce the chance of him catching us. There we go. Alright, and there's one guy around the corner as well. Oh, poor, poor guy. There's a guard in this room. You should be able to just walk around the corner and knife him in the back. Unless he turns around at the wrong time. We even ate his dog food on the way to kill him. That's what he gets. The control module for the security systems. That's it right there. Let's go investigate the rest of this area before we before we punch that control module. Okay, that's the door I think we're leaving through. Can't get through that. Not yet, at least. Croatian Luxury Resort, best in test. Just dying to get away in a relaxing vacation? You looked no further than the Croatia's finest luxury resort hotel. A resort, the Mediterranean Pearl. The resort was listed as the world's best vacation spot in the last issue of number one travel magazine, Ryzen. Uh, we're currently in Croatia. That should allow us to get out. Alright, where's Sed? Oh, there's, there's a bunch of shit in there we missed. Let's go back in. Oh, there's an enigma. Cool, cool. Alright, it looks like there's a, there's another enigma in this guy's office. Round where he was. Oh, a throwing knife. Very nice. I think that's not it though. There is an enigma in here. Oh, there it is. Nice. I think that should be it. Yeah. And there's one in block B as well, which we'll be going into later. No, no, no. That's downstairs. Let's go ahead and go down there. While we're here. like it's right oh other side right there nice okay so that should be all of them in this area Let's double check yep I'm good to go I'm guessing he's back in here, but I'm not. Oh, he is. Have you seen a little girl? Oh, 
Oh, this is that guy who asked me if I knew where his daughter was. Forget. No more questions. Oh, that's sad. Okay, let's go find the dude. This should be where he is, right here. There he is, okay, nice. Uh, uh, sometimes we have to find other ways of resistance <laughs> than violence. The slightest adjustment of the chemicals destabilizes the mixture. Structural sound the CO's, mold. So this is the guy making the mold. Secure the systems. It's done. Wow, Shimshin. What is your name, Nikola? Blaskovich. Blaskovich, yes, Blaskovich. So, now the security systems are, are, are disabled. You can go past this gate, back through the factory, out the Ooh, I gotta sneeze. block six where the command control building is located. Sneak inside, get the detonic battery. Please act urgently before anyone notices what you have done. That's the high angle. That's good luck. Whew. That was quite the sneeze. All right. Act urgently before anyone realizes what I have done. I think I can do that. Listen to me, Ingle. Go out the gate through the factory. Pass the new gate and into box six. This way. Well, this worked well. We're bringing this prison to the knees to its knees in the first day we're here. That's pretty good. And how the hell? Oh, there it is. Okay. <laughs> There's no one modern monitoring this area. Okay, wow. So there's a lot of a lot of shit in here. Let's go in here and get whatever this is first. Sounds like maybe Helga. Maybe we can kill her. Some food. I'm gonna go ahead and take that while we're here. Or whatever her name is. I don't, I don't know why I'm calling her Helga, but... That's another mechanic that they dropped in the next game, this lock picking thing. Okay, so we can go in here to catch whoever's in here. I'm guessing we'll go throughout this whole next area later. Before we do that, I kind of want to turn around and go see if we can get in this building real quick. Yeah, it doesn't look like it. Let's, let's make sure we're going to double check and... Yep. Okay. Through the door! I'm guessing this door will open those gates. Battery has to be in here somewhere. We do have a throwing knife, we have to remember that. That'll come in exceptionally useful. Especially in here, I believe. That was not particularly sneaky. <laughs> okay. Oh, okay, so this entire area is C1. It looks like there's an enigma down here at the end of this hallway. There it is. Degenerate killer duo executed today. Berlin, November 7th, 1960. 
The crowds have gathered on the streets and the squares of the city laughing and cheering when the degenerate serial killer duo were executed today on live TV. I feel so much safer now, knowing those no two criminals are no longer around, said one of the onlookers. A friend of a friend of mine was killed by those bastards, shouted another man. If nothing else, this is a valuable lesson to other degenerates out there that justice will eventually find them all. Okay. Interesting. We're gonna go ahead and go through here and find all the loot. Or grab all the loot. Since we killed everyone on this level. Undoubtedly it will get harder as we go through the levels, I would be willing to bet. Oh, there's another throwing knife, good. Is the beeping coming from these radios? Huh, I wonder if we deciphered this Morse code, if it would actually mean something. That'd be interesting to find out. All right, let's steal us a trophy. Excuse me, sir. <laughs> you bet it's correct? It probably is. Especially in games like this that have so much, you can tell, kind of like love thrown into them. They, they like to do, they like to do like hidden things like that. All right, there should be another, looks like if we turn around and walk all the way over here. There it is. Hmm, okay. A guy, a guard right to our right when we walk down here. What the hell? Why wouldn't that guy die? And I can like eight times in a row. That was kind of weird. another knife somewhere around here oh no we missed it on this guy matrix <laughs> all right this should be the battery we need we do need to find this last enigma piece looks like it's right to our left up here Oh, behind us. There it is, okay. I'm guessing, I think we'll go to this block next right here. Whatever this is. Uh, that was a bad idea. That was a really bad idea. It's immediate execution for this one. Ugh. I don't know why we grabbed the freaking battery directly out of that thing. Oh, they got all of us. You have it. Oh, 
He has this big piece of machinery in his hand they don't even realize. <laughs> what is she doing? So he's controlling it right now. Hell yeah! Oh, it didn't kill her though. It just like broke her face. Oh! I can't, I'm tied up. Oh, Jesus. Yeah, so Steen. The reason they won the war is because they have this superior technology in this alternate timeline. Um, they actually beat us to the atom bomb as well. And... That's why they may eventually made the U.S. surrender is because they bombed us. But that guy that's in jail right next to us, he actually invented most of the technology that they used to win the war. And so, yeah, yeah, no, I, I got you. I, I just figured I'd explain where we're at it. I, I'd explain some of the storyline. And so the reason we're here is we snuck in here to break him out. And so we helped him make a device that would control it. Hell yeah! Let's do it! We drove one of these in the other game as well. Open the garage door, steal a vehicle, and crash through the gate. Let's go. So yeah, supposedly well Jasper, she did she did seem to uh you know be kind of It has a gun on it. <laughs> she did seem to be kind of like not talking correctly, though it wasn't German, so we couldn't really understand it. That killed him. Yes, it did. All right, we lost a good amount of. A good amount of armor doing that. So, need to be careful. Also, the reload timer on this thing is pretty intense. You aren't intense, you're in a robot? Oh, I I see what you did there, because I said intense. No, I, I gather English isn't your first language, Inky Japs. But I was saying intense, which means, uh, like, severe. Very much so. Huh. 
Alright, we're letting our friend up in here. You know, I want it'd be funny if that actually tagged an octopus man in some other Okay, so what are you trying to do here? Defend the escape. Okay, so we're defending him until he can get in the car. Basically, is what I'm gathering. Hey, I'm opening the gates, Mr. Blaskovic! Alright, do it! You fool! Do what? For my kid. Ah, where are they? Depths, I think that's something you gotta bring up with the developers. Reload! I'm stuck here! Ah! Okay. The reload is insane on this thing. Oh, we died. Damn it. Look at them. They're horrendous. You gotta take a chill pill, my friend. <laughs> Who has to take a chill pill, Steen? Alright, let's back up a little bit so we can actually kill these guys. Alright, here they go. So we're gonna be aiming for the rocket guys first. We're trying to load all of these prisoners into our one little car. That should be most of them. We lost a good amount of armor. I believe we can pick more of it up. Yeah, we can, okay. So this is how we're supposed to... We need to pick this armor up that was dropped earlier. Look at him, he's just like... Letting the wrong things ruin his life. I agree completely. Alright, let's get out of here. He calls me Shim Sham, which is kind of an odd nickname. Nice. What? She's still alive? And where did she get those guns? What the hell? My compliments, but I might have underestimated the usefulness of your ape-like physique, Mr. Blaskovich. That you should. Talk about Tell plot me. twist, right? What is it? So that must be how she's alive for the next movie. Oh, uh, movie. Physical next physical game. For millennia, we have operated with utmost secrecy. Now. What do you do? Do you pray? Do no, no, Mamali, we don't pray. We invent. <laughs> we don't pray. Mamali, the technology developed by Daisichas is centuries ahead of anything you've ever seen or imagined, and highly dangerous in the wrong hands. The Nazis found our safe cube. They stole our secrets. They used them to win the war. Everything they have accomplished, <clears throat> everything was built upon our knowledge. But. 
Is this the end of the game? No, 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 no. I think I think we're maybe about halfway through something like that. Hundreds of them hidden in the secret places of the world. Hundreds, some small and tentative like the ones the Nazis found. Others, great halls of knowledge stacked high, magnificent inventions, things that to you will seem like magic. Now, I can open for you the gates to such a place. Getting there will be a challenge. What will it take? The safekeepers hidden. But he's telling us what we're gonna have to do for the rest of the mission. We will need a U-boat capable of great depths. That's all. We cannot just walk up and steal a gosh darn Nazi U-boat. Can we? I know what is that? A U -boat, but for my plan to work, I need this thing operational. Can you do it? I'm an Amadas Yichud engineer. I can do this in my sleep. We would need some additional features on it, too. I will prepare a specification for you. Blaskovich, <laughs> help him out, sir, if you'd be so kind. Uh, we always have to do everything. It's like we're the only able-bodied, mentally, Whoa. fully mentally ready person here. Oh, this is the dude we broke out. Okay, so he did come with us. Blaskovich, I will need some cool. welding equipment, please. All right, let's go find some welding equipment. This is, yes. that's not why. Oh, so we, now we have a bunch of prisoners with us. Organization of yours, but it's some kind of supernatural engineering. So in this alternate world, is Hitler still alive? We believe in God. Bomb bait. Who's bomb bait? Is 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 a it's a philosophy. It is a way of understanding God through knowledge. It is based on pure reason, pure rational thought, not supernatural bupkis. Huh. So everything you have created, what are you <clears throat> planning on using all that stuff for? Oh, you don't understand, Amale. There was never any purpose. Oh, the prisoner who broke out. It's this guy. Oh, yeah, yeah, you're right. Bombay. That's what it says right there. We create to commune with God. Do you see that? You've lost me. It's like mathematical equations. 